Sex work is really often misunderstood, misrepresented, and stigmatized. A line of people wrapped around the block for the opening night of the Sex Workers Pop-Up, an exhibition which features artwork and performances about sex work from around the world. Co-curator of the Sex Workers Pop-Up, Davian Trentman, hopes to combat the stigma surrounding sex work with art and authentic storytelling. What we want visitors to walk away with is the message that sex work is work and it shouldn't be criminalized. The Sex Worker Pop-Up Shop addresses sex work within 10 different countries with work from 22 different artists, 17 of which have a sex worker background. Right now, the United States mostly criminalizes anyone who's trading sex, so if you're doing sex work, which includes trading sex for money, food, housing, drugs, any other kind of resource, right? Um, you could go to jail and be arrested and face criminal consequences for what you're doing. The exhibit includes work from artists like Molly Crabapple, Khalil West, and Carlos Moda. Nina Liu, an organizer with Decrim New York, hopes their work highlights issues within sex work that need to be addressed, such as sex worker rights, migration, police violence, and poverty. So what we're trying to do is make it so that those activities are no longer criminalized and people can do what they need to do to survive um, while being safe and also free from incarceration. The Sex Workers Pop-Up came together with the support of independent grant-making network Open Society Foundations. Visitors can expect to see photographs, video storytelling, and a portrait series commissioned specifically for the exhibit. CEO of Scarlet Alliance, Australia's National Peak Sex Worker Organization, Jules Kim, explained the importance of the exhibition for the community. Events like this help to reframe people's understandings of sex work and realize that really we are a very diverse um, group of people and that we are members of the community um, and that there is a, a wide range of reasons as to why we might be sex working um, and that like other members of the community that we deserve rights. While the exhibition is only open for a limited time, each night it features a panel discussion where organizers discuss information surrounding sex work. Reporting for BronxNet, Jericho Tran.